It's the most we messy time of the year. It's exquisite belly and everyone telling you watch more of my videos. It's the most we missy time of the year. I don't know what I'm doing, but hello everybody. Welcome to another day of weed miss. I still don't have anything like I usually have, but what I do have is a little bit of weeb. Not much of the muss, but there is some of the weeb. Or some of the otaku, and not much of the Hanukkah. Because you have weed miss slash otanika. Otaku Hanukkah. Yeah. <laughs> You'll have to let me know what you think of that. Today, we're going to be looking at my early Sebastian impressions. Now I know, last year I told you how to do the Sebastian impression, and I got some, a few questions about like what chest voice is, and head voice, what that means. The best way I can explain it is when you go through your voice, and you go from the lowest register to the highest, there's a little shift in your voice. So if it went, uh, uh, right here, uh, it is, uh, uh, when you flip the switch to, uh, 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 that, that's head voice. You're talking in head voice, you're talking in falsetto. But then you go down into your chest where you feel it. Like, uh, so that's head voice and chest voice if you want to figure out what it is. And in between is shaggy voice. Uh, like, man, I don't even know what we're doing. That's why we're gonna just pop right into the video. Smash like, everybody. I've been doing the Sebastian impression probably since 20... 2015, maybe? 2016? So yeah, four years, I was gonna say. Uh of me trying to do it. And then 2017, late 2017, is when I started, how to word this, I was good enough to be showcasing my talent. And oh boy, it was bad. And not just kinda bad, it was really bad. So that's why I'm gonna try and give you some confidence for those of you who really want to get into it, but you're like, no, it sounds terrible. You do such a good impression, and I'm like, first of all, eh, I kind of do a good impression, and second of all, I was much worse. So we're just gonna pop right into that. The first thing that I think would be easy to go back to would be my first videos. So you go to my videos, you go to sort by date added oldest. We'll work our way back in time from earlier to now. So if I was going to talk like Sebastian, this is where I am now. This is me trying. Now if I was going to do something with a friend, I w it would probably sound a little bit more like this. A little too much like me uh, trying to do a British accent. Uh, but if I was going to try, this here is probably my best off the cusp Sebastian impression. Now, Where's a good place to start? We could go to the one that everybody loves, which is most popular, this one, with 37,000 views. First of all, thank you everyone for 37,000 views. Smash like if you are part of the people who saw that, and smash subscribe. 80% of the people who watch my videos aren't subscribed, so let's try and get that to be the actual, let's, 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 sw let's swip it, swip it, swip it. Tears have filled his eyes, which I kissed away. Sebastian. <laughs> he moaned out as I continued going in and out of him slowly. That's, that's a year ago. That was a year ago. Um, See, whole year ago. Good golly. Here's me a bit more with friends from a while ago. I can't promise. Yes, you can. But I feel like you should do some sort of test to just show how loyal you really are, Claude. <clears throat> okay, not bad, not bad, not bad. It, it, it kind of sounds like me, but not quite enough chest. 
I'm actually using the same microphone as I did then, so there's no difference in the microphone quality, other than there was some EQing that I did on here that I don't actually particularly like. The only difference is there's not a whole lot of bass. To just show how loyal you really are. It's not bad. It's not quite confident, but it is, it is there. Moving back to... Here's my intro video. Here's my intro video. I need to stop talking like Sebastian for a second. Uh, this was the video that I did for the Black Butler voice acting crew. It was introducing myself as the Sebastian voice actor for it on Amino, which we're gonna be getting to Amino. Oh, oh, don't you worry. I was accepted and they were like, okay, so we'd like to just introduce the new people. So this is what it sounded like January 15th of 2018. Oh, I was also Claude. Good evening. I'm happy you decided to watch this video. You could at least sound excited. What are you on about, Michaelis? Well, if you're going to say that you're happy, make it believable. Honestly, kind of a butler, can't I? Admit. As I was saying, no wonder you didn't get the young lord so. <laughs> As I was saying, goodness, Claude. Haven't you even introduced the bloody thing? A good butler doesn't watch his sentences. He doesn't wait for another ice age either. Let me take it from here. Ooh. Ooh, that was bad. Oh yeah, welcome to Try Not to Cringe Miss Part 2. <laughs> I love this of 2020. <laughs> what are you going on about, Michaelis? What are you doing, Faustus? I, I'm Sebastian Michaelis. I sound like Stitch. I said this last year, but I sound like Stitch. Oh, Hannah means family. A really bad Stitch impression. Ooh, ooh. This is, this is roughly, actually, where about where I hear most people who just start out. Good. This is roughly what they sound like. And the biggest problem, like I said, was to get, uh, last year, was that a lot of times you get your voice stuck in the, in the back of your throat because, because you want it to be, you want it to be lower. That's what a lot of girls do to sound like a guy. They throw their the voice at the back of their throat so it's a bit lower. But that's not what you want to do. You want to open your voice, open your chest, and you just talk. Normally. Here's my normal voice. Here's me. I don't have a particularly low voice, actually. So here's my voice, and then I just let it kind of reverberate around a little bit. I, uh, you make this, this gruffy voice uh, a lot, and you just kind of have it be there in the background of your voice, just as a mixture in the pot of the Sebastian Michaelis voice. Instead of trying to be low like this, and yet I still have newer, or older, older. This was the first video, first video I've ever uploaded on the channel. I did not upload a different one, well, I did upload a different version of this that there were a bunch of uh, problems with. There were a bunch of um, editing problems. This is something that a friend of mine wrote and wanted me to voice act and put together and I was just like, all right, first video up. <laughs> and then that's what this is. It's also narrated by Tamaki for whatever reason. Sebastian. A voice called from afar. That was the moment when Connor opened his eyes and found himself in the Phantom Hive Manor, looking exactly like Sebastian Michaelis. Quick note. Uh, my friend is a big fan of Sea Dog VA. <coughs> was a leader of the Amino at one point, and um, so yeah, the, this is about Sebastian and Sea Dog VA. If you couldn't tell about the, that, which is really cringy to me, because like at this time, I like you know where I was and what I was liking, and now I've just like I don't even. Like, that's just not what I watch anymore. <laughs> it's just... Uh, tastes change so much. But I know you would never leave me. Never leave me, right? 
<laughs> also, we're like less than 100 subscribers away from 1,000 subscribers. So smash that subscribe button. As Connor. Sebastian. This is my Tommy King impression situation. from then, and my my impression hasn't gotten much better, but my voice acting has gotten better. As you can hear, my words are pretty thumbled and just aren't articulate. A piece of paper caught his eye. As he reached for the paper to then read the words written onto it, he groaned and started to say something rather vulgar. I was also doing, trying not to uh, pop the microphone go, What was that noise? <laughs> that was the sound of like my life leaving my throat. As he reached for the paper. As he reached for the paper. As he reached for the paper. Take the time to just go reached for the paper. That's where uh, a bunch of like warm ups would be good. You know, like when you go through chorus, they're not just making you say things because it's fun and goofy. It's because it warms up your voice so that you can hit the ranges you need to and you can be articulate. Do I do that? Am I am I being a bit of a hypocrite right now? Yes, I am. Because <laughs> I don't really ever do that whenever I record, but that's only because I'm lazy. I have no other excuse, but don't be me. It's only fair for you to do that today. I hope you're having an awful time turning for young monsters up. All right, so this actually isn't bad when it comes to chest voice, and it isn't... Stop shaking. Uh, when it, it's not bad when it comes to articulation, and it's not bad when it comes to a little bit of the mannerisms of how Sebastian talks. He kind of lets his words go. He's not very fast when he, when he speaks. He goes the way that he wants to speak. He's not going to rush for anyone, because he is a demon who is better than any human alive anything at all he is the best the mannerisms are there the chest is kind of there but the voice the openness of the throat is not there i'm trying to put it right here uh oh i remember exactly what it was i was trying to force my adam's apple forward because that made my voice lower but really what you're doing is you're just straining yourself and then you suck. I want to hear my Connor impression. It stays to be hell on earth. There it is. There's. This is why he's called it. Man, I could I could take a whole video looking at my oldest videos. Smash like. Leave a comment if you want to see that video. Anyway, that's my oldest stuff. But like I said earlier, there are older. Here is the day that I got accepted into the Sea Dog VA. Uh, Black Butler impression voice acting group. November 11th, 2017 at 5.30 p.m. I remember being in this house upstairs just in my tiny closet with my like, and just grabbing it and just just pacing around my my room because I was so nervous and this was my impression. Hello, hello and I'm glad to be here with all of you beautiful weeps. Even though it's just us. Like any voice actor or any person who can do impressions, I was just showing off this entire time all of the impressions I could do. And that's what this was. So I think I basically just did Tamaki, a little bit of Claude, and I did Sebastian, of course, because that's who I was auditioning for. And I switched personalities way too often. Oh, Phantom Brat. Oh, you got that right. Oh, boy. Oh. Oh. He, uh, it was, it was, his name was, uh, Phantom Brat, and, like, literally everyone would say, Oh, Phantom Brat. Oh, you got that right. <laughs> oh, 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 I'm so, I'm so into the Sebastian impression. <laughs> Nobody cares. Shut up. <laughs> Nobody cares. Just stop. I'm glad you're having fun. But nobody cares. Please stop being annoying. Don't be me. <laughs> oh, and oh my lord, that sounded what? How? How can you do it? I mean, see, I was always like, oh, give me some tea. Oh, I don't like that tea. Oh, oh. Uh, one brat, and I do not like it. What did you say, dude? Dude, what did you say at the end? Brah. Brah. 
It's gotten better, but I'm basically the same person. Go me. I haven't changed in three years. <laughs> oh yeah, and it, I was I was Tom McKee 15 in the game. 15 percent in the game, because you can say 15 percent or more on Tom Assurance, which was an inside joke with like the very first people I ever did my Tamaki impression with. I don't even remember how it started. I think I was just talking about how Tamaki um, would like, what would happen if the host club tried to sell like life insurance because people, because girls would just swoon over and die for them. So it was like, Tom Assurance, Tamaki saving you 15% or more on Tom Assurance. Are you in good hands? I know that's two. The whole point was to switch over and combine as many insurance companies as possible. Don't add me, okay? Or do at uh, Copix, at Tom Assurance on Twitter or on Parlor or on just about anything else. One, two, three. <laughs> I wasn't out of breath, I just stopped tongue rolling. Anyway, I was better at it earlier. I'll give myself the win there. <laughs> I think I'm done here. Anyway, I'm getting I'm getting off track and I'm just going through memories. So let's go to the one slightly earlier version of my impression that I can find. It's I think a month earlier, but it's the earliest version of my impression that I can find. All right, here we are, the Oron High School Host Club Amino, where I started my first impressions, and I couldn't find anything from earlier than that. Uh, I think they've all been deleted. I try to save all the ones I can, but there are just some here that's like, I don't think, the, the rest of them are going to be my Tomaki impressions, so. This is my friend who introduced me to it and uh, was the leader of the Z-Dog game, you know. Ah, uh, look at this. It's, you can barely see it, but it's Tomaki's face photoshopped on top of um, Jake from State Farm. <laughs> I didn't do it, uh, somebody else gave it to me because of my name. And it, it wasn't really fan art. I have other fan art. It was definitely the first one that somebody gave to me, so I kinda wanna count it as fan art, but I do have earlier fan art. I would, I don't know if I can find it, but I hope so. Welcome, poor man, to a world of beauty. I am simply one hell of a bachelor. Ooh. I'm simply one hell of a Sebastian Michaelis knockoff. Hashtag throwback. I sound like Severus Snape. I am a throwback butler. Hashtag Thursday Throwback. All right, so here it is. What's the date? Uh, October 20th, 2017. I'm simply one hell of a butler. I'm simply one hell of a butler. Hello, all mind slave. Oh yeah, I was still in school. Oh, young me. I am simply one hell of a butler. Mm-mm, mm-mm, I don't like that. I don't like it. <laughs> It's somewhere in between I'm simply one hell of a butler and I'm and like it's like somewhere in between that that I don't like. It's just not good. <laughs> it's so bad. I'm simply one hell of a butler. I don't I don't even know how to recreate it. I don't like I can't believe my vocal cords made that. <laughs> so I'm glad I have this archived on YouTube now before Amino decides to delete all of the chats from over a year ago or whatever. They almost did that. I was like, I'm, I've am i been waiting for this weeb miss to give it to you guys 
uh, just like have, I was gonna do it last week, Miss, but I was like, no, I wanna give it, you know, at least three years. I don't wanna do two years, I wanna do three years. I've just been waiting for like a full year to do this, and then I mean, like my chats weren't working, and it looked like they deleted all chats from over a year ago, and I was like, no! <laughs> all I wanted was to show, so I'm glad I have this now. But yes, for one, one last memory. I am simply one hell of a butler. One hell of a bachelor. Mm -mm. Oh boy. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I don't like that. So yeah, that's my dive into the past from three years ago. From where my Sebastian impression was. And then I spent the next year just being part of the voice acting crew. We did a whole lot of fun things, a whole bunch of uh, panels for, well, we did a panel a month and we did a whole bunch of fun stuff, and I just got to constantly keep working on my impression, which was awesome. And of course I met friends and people who I've done a bunch of videos with, like the Uno video was from, with a bunch of friends from that Black Butler voice acting group on the Dog game, you know, like those were the actual people from two years ago now. Um, almost three, because I think that was February. But uh, I, it's all just to say, if you're, if you don't like it, just practice. People are going to like it, even at stages that are as terrible as mine were. It's all about having fun, not who can do the best. I do get competitive. Competitive in ways that's like, wow, go to my latest video. Here's me writing a, a Weebmas fan fiction. And then you go to the, the description, and you go to donate, of course. But there's also the dragonstreasuretea.com, and you open that up, and then you go to login if you want. You go to the catalog, what kind of teas you want, mugs, mugware, if you just want to get some of that. Let's go to some teas, some black teas. What are some fun things? Pum, pum, pumpkin spice from, from uh, Soul Eater. Oh man, I missed that one. Ah, that's a good one. Here's Sebastian's boarding Earl Grey Vanilla Green Tea. We were just talking about uh, Sebastian, so let's go open that. We'll get some. I wonder if there's gonna... I, I really hope that there's some Oron. Yo, listen, man. Listen, listen. I think that you should have a... I think you should have a Copix tea. I think that if everybody right now spends money and goes to Dragon's Treasure Tea and leaves a comment that says, we need a Copix flavor, then we should get it. Everybody go, go now, buy some tea, and leave a note with your order that says we need a Copix flavor. But we also need an Oron flavor. Get on that, get on the Oron flavor. Catalog, um, teaware products. There's a bunch of stuff here that's sold out, and I'm really upset. Look at this, I'm so upset that's sold out. But here's a nice tea maker. Uh, here's some empty, uh, reusable tea bags that you can use, but there's also this, which I did show, or will be showing, kind of briefly how that works in another video. Anyway, I'm gonna buy one of these. I'm gonna add to cart, look, it's $21.99. For that, it's $28. Special instructions for seller. Have a Mary. Weebness. Also, you need a an Boron High School Host Club flavor and a Copix flavor. Just like that. Do it. Do it that way. Or um or o o otonica for my Jewish viewers, because I know you. there are some. Smash like if you're Jewish and you celebrate Otonica. Check out, I'm gonna buy this. Now of course, here's the discount code. I can put in, they don't stack so you can't use both, but here's this, you can use Tom Assurance 20. Apply, boom, $4 off. Look at that, now it's $25 instead of like 30 bucks which I know that's $5, but you know what? That's that. And of course you wanna give a tip. Now I'm nice. 
you want to give you want to give you want to give a tip be 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 kind it's weed mist season be kind now before this goes away this here 3622 which means i've just made $3.62 which means that $3.62 that is going directly into the Tiltify donation. Like, I just bought tea, and a tea maker, a, a loose leaf tea filter, and I donated with one purchase. So I will be signing in and donating that amount of money, plus I'm gonna, I'm gonna be donating it all at once, at one lump sum at a time. So it's gonna be uh, super awesome, man. I'll probably put it in as, anonymous or no I'll put in our display name that says all y'all <laughs> so there it is everybody thank you all so much for joining me on this flashback into my past and how I got started I'd love to do more with this more of this with you leave some suggestions in the comments below it helps me know what you want to see as well as boost my videos in the algorithm be sure to do that i'd love to do some more talk about how i kind of got started into anything if anyone's interested and i could tell you what i did and how i improved and that'd be really fun and make sure to get yourself some dragons <laughs> make sure to get yourself some dragons treasure tea using coupon code tom assurance for orders $10 or more, saving $2, or Tom Assurance 20 on orders $20 or more, saving you $4 on your entire purchase. Also be sure to donate. We also passed 900 subscribers. We're less than 100 subscribers away from 1,000 subscribers. Let's make it happen. Thank you all so much for joining me. And may ye all have a merry Weedmas slash happy Otonica. Peace.